Hello guys, I am Engineer Muhammad Adnan Khan and you are watching my YouTube channel Being Engineer. In this video, we will discuss about the defects that occur in painting after the paint is applied to the surface. How these defects can be removed and what are the reasons for these defects. These things will be discussed in this video. You are requested to watch full video. Subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you can get my new and latest videos. Here are some defects that we are going to discuss in this video. That is flashing, blistering, fading, running, grinning, sagging, chalking, flaking, mildew, sagging and checking. These will be discussed one by one in the upcoming slides. So the first one is flashing. What is flashing? The formation of glossy patches on the painted surface is called as flashing. As you can see, here are the glossy patches that appear on the painted surface is called as flashing. This is caused due to the poor quality of paint, weathering action or it could be due to poor workmanship. The next one is blistering. Blistering and peeling are defects in which swelling of the paint film occurs. As you can see in this picture in the background, the swelling of the paint had occurred. This swelling is caused by the formation of air bubble under the paint film due to the presence of moisture or oil grease matter. These defects can be eliminated by using porous paints like emulsion paints instead of non-porous paints such as oil paints, enamel paints, etc. The third one is fading. Fading is the discoloration of the paint surface. As you can see in this picture, some of the portion of the painted surface has dis uh, discolorized. This is mainly due to the atmospheric agencies such as sunlight, moisture, etc. To prevent fading or discoloration, weathering resistant pigments should be used in the paint. Number four, greening. The paint film should be opaque enough to cover the background surface. The visibility of a background due to insufficient opacity of paint film even after the final coat is called as greening. Number five, sagging. When a surface is to be painted with a thick layer of paint, the thick paint film may run downwards and forms sagging of paint. It is similar to running, but here the sag of paint is very thick. Number six, running. When a thin layer of paint is coating on a glossy and smooth surface, the paint may run back and sometimes leaves small areas of surface uncovered. This defect is called as running. Number seven, flaking. The detachment of paint film from surface is called flaking. As you can see in this picture, the paint has detached from the surface. It occurs when the bond between the surface and paint film is poor. To prevent this, the surface should be cleaned and rubbed with abrasive paper before applying paint. Chalking Chalking is the formation of powder on the painted surface. This is due to the use of insufficient oil in the primer. It can be removed by using sufficient oil in the primer applying paint at recommended spreading rate, etc. Number 9. Checking It is similar to alligatoring, but here cracks are limited to a small area unlike alligatoring cracks. It is caused when the paint is applied during very cold weather or due to the application of paint prior to drying of undercoat. Last but not least, number 10, mildew. Mildew is a form of fungus which grows well 
in warm, moist and dark places. It grows rapidly and develops the grey coloured patches on the painted surface. It also affects the bond between paint coats. It can be prevented by keeping the surface dry and clean before applying paint. If there is any trace of mildew growth, then wash the surface with solution of bleach. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.